some days it's kind of like, oh my gosh, it's a little intimidating. We need to try these 20 barrels. Um, you know, have the Ubers ready. <laughs> intimidating, maybe, but it's a challenge John Abbott Young and the rest of the crew at Abbott and Wallace Distilling are definitely ready to tackle. It's definitely uh, a day that we really look forward to. Their whiskey waits in barrels for two years before they even get a taste. What all this has been leading up to. So uh, how do you ours. sample whiskey from a barrel? We'll use this special ring hammer to hammer out the bung. You got it. It's called thieving. And this special tool called a thief. It's, it's kind of a traditional copper pipe. It's got a hole on one end, a hole on the other. They're able to get a sample from the barrel without disturbing the rest of the contents or having to dump it all out. So we're able to stick it into the bung hole, put your thumb on the top, pull it out, and get a beautiful amber sample of your whiskey. The oak in each barrel gives a slightly different taste. You get sweet barrels, you get spicy barrels. Some taste like a barnyard. It's all part of the mix. And some whiskeys need a little more time. It's also like, hey, I'm not quite ready. I'm still sleeping. Uh, let me chill out for another six months and I'll get to know you in the springtime. Which is why you thieve in the first place. Provide us a good opportunity to dive into the barrel, get to know it a little bit, whisper to it maybe a little bit, hear what it has to say. And this upcoming release of Abbott and Wallace's Colorado Straight Rye Whiskey is special. It's one of the whiskeys they barreled when they opened in June of 2017. Now we're finally going to get in there and see, see what magic is happening. Which means this whiskey, aging safely in its barrel for the last three years, is one of the few things that hasn't felt the impact of a global pandemic. Yeah, we're pretty excited about it. The rye's out here are really special. And this this will live up to it. I'm, I'm kind of getting the goosebumps just talking about it. That is awesome. I love how he described the process of that. Abbott and Wallace can be found in downtown Longmont. The whiskey and rum distillery is home to Long Tucky Spirits. How about that, Gary? I like that a lot. Might have to check that out yeah. one of these days with the Uber in hand. I oh, guess. yes, of course. Yeah.